This is gonna be weirder than usual. Can't be helped. You called me. So here I am. I know I shut you out sometimes. I'm always glad to hear from you. It's just that I get my hopes up. So many times it's led to nothing. I found nothing. It's like we live in a room and there's a poster on the wall. We stare at it and we think that's the whole world. The room and the poster. The picture's something nice. A landscape, a famous person. Like in that movie, what is it called? The prison movie. The room's a cell and the picture, it's different. For each of us, it can be beautiful or terrible, but we're all transfixed. But it's all a lie, something to distract us from the truth. They're lying to us. We're lying to ourselves. The room's not the world. The world is much bigger and much stranger. There's a hole hidden behind that poster that leads to the real world. We all feel safe in that room. But sometimes, sometimes something crawls out from behind the poster. And the ones that see it happen freak out and try to forget what they saw. I'm here. Why did you bring me here? Hello? Okay. Anyone here? Oh, look at that. I finally get to explore this place. I'm so excited. Is anything to read here? Nope. Uh, okay, gotta go through here, I guess? Okay. What's this? Prohibited items reminder. Certain objects are not allowed inside the bureau. Recent incidents have necessitated an issue from to prohibitive materials, unauthorized weapons, pagers, laptops, smart watches, smartphones, smart gaming devices, anything smart, number two pencils, any objects considered iconic representations of an archetypal concept. All material under bureau investigation is to be brought in through the private entrances. If you see any lobby personnel in breach of these policies, please notify your superior immediately. Huh. Interesting. Internal lockdown. In effect, building lockdown is in effect. Multiple containment breaches detected. Multiple building shifts detected. Head of research override. HRA protocol activated. There's so much in just this one lobby alone. Gr grief. All right. Let's get up here and see what's what. There's, th there's stuff everywhere that I have to explore. Thank goodness the door is open automatically this for me. Seal. I saw it a long time ago. I keep seeing it in my dreams. Federal Bureau of Control. There's a pneumatic tube system for messages. What's this? Bureau expenditures. Staffing, surveillance, redacted, data center initiative, construction, redacted, redacted. Office equipment, janitorial costs, redacted, mold removal, HQ livability costs. Interesting. Yeah, this is the stuff that was in the um, the first 17 minutes from IGN. Is this, this is Dr. Casper Darling. The ja our bureau at work. That's the janitor. If you haven't seen the trailer before, that is his name is Ati and he's Finnish. That is director Zachariah Trench. Amazing. Bathrooms. He actually never went in here. Unisex apparently. Huh. No documents in here? Nothing? Okay. I need to explore every bit of this place as much as I can. Federal Bureau of Control. All these years I've been looking for them and they were hiding in plain sight. This is this this looks so good. Right now. Hmm, what's in here? 
clear and the trailers never went in here. What's this? Security order. Whoops. Menu. Menu. Work. Mm. Oops. Uh, this one. A shark in... Still those secure uh, the permission to following shoot to kill. Oh, oh my. Good grief. Something, something sharks, something, something here to kill. What is this? R4 reports reminder. As you all know, the R4 reports are due by the end of the week. If you need an extension, please request form R4.e from Superior if you think you're exempt. For following an R4, then you need to get permission from your department chief. So, R4s are mandatory under section 75.2 of the employee manual. If your R4 requires into the mental, the inter, interdepartmental claims, then please contact the department doctor, department head, Dr. Darling, Ms. Marshall, Mr. Salvador, Mr. Kirkland as needed. Huh. Interesting. There's a lot of like office fluff, except for the redacted stuff that I've already found, which is interesting to say the least. Hello? Oh, there he is. Nothing in here. Hello, Ati. How are you doing? Hey, excuse me. There you are. You are here about the job. Janitor's assistant. You need to go to the interview. Go that way to the elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. Got it. Very good. I'm Ahti, the janitor, by the way. You work for me. You can say I sent you. If they don't hire you, they tell you are no element. There be work for the axe. Take them behind the sauna, you out. <laughs> I've done enough night shift loner jobs to know it makes us come off weird. Ahti, the janitor, is a friendly face in my book. Better than somebody with no face at all. Think about it. No face. Did you? But that said, I know what you're thinking. If there's an axe murderer around, that's him. Yes. Yeah, apparently he can read minds, which is very strange. Uh, oh. I think that's progress. Let's go over here and see what's what. Wait, this is the, um, oh, it's one big, wait, was it one big loop? Wait, hang on a second. I came up from there. I, wait, this isn't the... Unless there's... Oh, okay. It's messing with my head now. Ah, oh, what fun. What fun. Let's go down. The cell and the poster. I was 11 years old the first time I saw behind the poster. They told me I imagined it. I've been trying to pull it down ever since. Will you help? Okay. Did I lose you there for a moment? <laughs> you know what's on my mind. My baby brother, Dylan. 17 years since the men of this bureau took him. Wow. Just wow. Uh-oh. That's not good. Oh, what is going on in this place? Approved terminology reminder. While pending any notifications of death relating to the Willow AWE, please adhere to the following guidelines. Words, phrase to use in the service of his or her country, regret, proud, or pride, and they will be remembered. Words, phrases to avoid Alaska, scissors, blood, bleed, loss, apologies, sorry. Wow. That is so strange. Damn. Well, it appears this lockdown is still in effect, but let us see what, we can, what else we can find in this strange 
strange place. Yeah, this game looks so pretty too. Uh, unfortunately, there's no like FOV options, but uh, I, I don't really care. Trench, do not disturb. Oops, wrong one. Barbara, I'm not to be disturbed. Can someone? I think I, I can't trust them, Barbara. Not a single one. Oof. It's okay. So central executive. <laughs> What was that? Hello? Shit. Shit, shit, shit. You want me to pick it up? The murder weapon? Really? Wait, who are you even talking to? Something's outside. Was coming here a mistake? Um, considering the fact that this man blew his brains out <laughs> against the wall, uh, yeah. Let's pick this up. And there goes the poster. Objects of power can cause or be results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one. Ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner and you, <laughs> you're it. The astral plane, Jesse. I thought you could read my. Oh, it's so good. This is so pretty. Whoops. There's no photo mode. Damn it. Well, um, I guess we. All... The only thing left to do is go forward. Interesting. Huh. Yep. That's how that works. Yeah, Jesse Faden has powers of her own. Pistol is mine now. Okay, now I have a gun. <laughs> a strange, otherworldly gun that doesn't require ammunition. Oh, I am bad at aiming. Also, the ammo for this gun comes back over time, like that. So I don't actually have to reload it. Oops, that is not what I meant to do. <laughs> Yeah, I think the bridge was supposed to, yeah, it was a bridge was supposed to open up for me. Okay, what else do you want me to do, board? Kill the, kill the things? Sure, why not? Uh, oh, okay, R switches shoulders. I need to, I need to learn not to press R to reload anything because I don't need to reload. Come on. Easy. Any more? Oh, crap. Eat it. Not dead? Dead now. And so is he. Nice. Not the most perfect run, but uh... pyramid spoke to me and it was just noise and I understood every word and this gun's alive you know what I'm happy I'm happy to be here okay guess we gotta proceed Things further to down outside uh, is it safe to go uh okay so that's ah yes a strange enemy faction. You can't let this happen. 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 You stopped it. You. Oh, thank you. 
was... horror. Uh-oh. I don't know what's the button. I forgot what my buttons are dodge. Actually, oh, his guard. Open collectibles. What is this? Uh, the bureau has many internal security personnel. The his was quick to take advantage of this fact. His guards used to send it to shoot bullpup rifles to carry parts of corruption. Armored guards carry pump action shotguns. No observed paranatural active abilities, with the exception that certain his guards are protected by a shielding of dense his resonance, capable of stopping bullets. Is this shielding a result of prolonged his corruption? Did this, does the his mature in organic hosts over time, or data is needed? Did the his target individuals with combat training? Does the his have that level of cognizance? Does it utilize hosts for tasks they are best suited to? Combat trained hosts are reserved for combat? These are all questions for later, though it is obvious that corrupted individuals retain knowledge on the use of their weapons. The director of the bureau, Zachariah Trench. Hello. That. Okay, so I've got an empty mod slot, so I can, I guess I can put this in here. Uh, I guess that's that. Can I still, can, can I access this? No, I don't have the required clearance. Hmm. Uh, I need to head into central executive though. Oh wait, no, hold on. It's back this way, isn't it? Wasn't it? Yeah, it's this way. Uh, oh, it's, it's still locked. Shit. Uh, that means I need to find clearance. Oh, okay. I can still head to central executive this way. I guess that means, whoa, look at that. I get, yeah, this is, uh, okay. Secure line of communication. Guidance. Oh, Stop hello. Fire. Okay. Is this the dead man? Okay. Shit. Eat it. Oh, that was close. Man, look at this destruction engine. Holy crap, when they advertise that as such, man, they were not joking. Okay. Ooh, look at that. Yeah. Oh, crap. Nope, not gonna they're not gonna take me alive. Eat it. One two. Okay. Any more? Ooh, a mod. Wait, what? What? What's that? What is that? Unrefined reading. The hell are these? Oh, it's oh these are crafting materials. Um max occupancy six persons. Proceed further into the bureau. Those voices, man. What is this? Hello. Correspondence. Dinner reservations. There is Shayam Roy, rifle either. Remember she's 3046. Okay. Well. Unlimited ammo, yes, it is, Nick. This gun has unlimited ammo, but a limited magazine size, so I can fire as much as I want, and then I have to wait for it to recharge. Like that, see? Wow, look at that, man. You can even tear off the wood from the from the walls. Oh, it's so good. Oh, whoops. That I did not mean to do that. Uh what's this? Reminder. If you experience an unanticipated building shift, follow these simple steps. 1. Search the room for any altered items or objects of power. 2. Carry the altered item or object of power to the nearest safe room. 3. Wait for bureau staff to find you and the object. If there are no altered items or objects of power in the vicinity, then reach your supervisor via the nearest intercom and await further instructions. Thank you for your attention. Yeah, the physics engine, man. Also, you notice how the pictures of the director have changed from that old man to her? Food for thought about this game, especially about this game, man. I'm just gonna look around for as much lore as I can before moving on. Ooh, executive meeting minutes. Rising costs of altered world events response. Update on mold eradication efforts. Upcoming annual salary review. New supplier of coffee filters to be found and vetted. Wow. Also, melee! Yeah, everything just goes flying. Good grief. I love this. Yeah, and that's also totally not weird. Okay, so there's a shelter. Uh, yeah, there's a shelter here. I think I'm supposed to go that way, but I want to see what's in here. Anyone home? Whoops. A box. A health boost. Ooh. Ooh. Yes. Yes, I would like that. What is this? Marshall. AW. Oops. AW investigations. Marshall, we checked out the suspected altered world events in Duluth. Wasn't anything like this, just a house fire before this and a malfunctioning closed dryer before that. My team is getting pretty sick of duds. We need to find a better way to sort the fake AWEs from the real things, or you need to rotate those field agents off for a bit. Anyway, we're en route to Sherman Ranch. Next one on the list, let's hope it's a little livelier there. Interesting. Yeah, you came in here and like this safe shelter did absolutely nothing for you. I am s I am so sorry. But we have to move on into Central Executive to get us the clear. Oh, I love that stuff. Hissing sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss burrowing into everything in this place. It's a big place. Is the hiss your enemy? 
All right, it's our enemy. Someone's telling you something, Jesse. I don't that know what it is. Contagious. It burrows in like an infuriating melody that makes you hum it over and over. Yeah, music can. You can probably play music to like try and and fight it, I guess. But then. Most of, a lot of the music in here on the radios, I guess, is probably going to be copyrighted music, so I can't play them. How to handle unscheduled visitors and entry line. Welcome to the Federal Bureau of Control, established in 1964 as part of an effort to strengthen government relations. Proud to serve the United States and her people as we strive for transparency and excellence in all aspects of our esteemed nation's infrastructure. If they do not leave, then ask them some questions. Wow. Do not leave, then ask them these questions. Are you here to see someone? Are you from New York City or just visiting? How did you find this place? If their answers are sufficiently harmless to explain that this is a secure federal office and they'll need to leave. If their answers seem redacted, escort them to a private room, perform gunner's psychological assessment. If their responses within this explore range of deviants, then redact it immediately. Remember, there's no such thing as too suspicious. Wow. Oh, I love all of this lore. Also, oops. What is this? Urban legends. The urban legends are believed to affect the creation of altered materials, but can also dictate the characteristics of an altered world event. Urban legends are understood as modern evolution of Jung's archetypes. We recognize certain blame. Uh, additionally, proven that urban legends can be even artificially be redacted in popular culture using our bureau made anthology television programs. Disease are so human imagination exacerbates the details. Certain paranormal phenom paranatural phenomena, paranatural phenomena contains clear elements of popularized folklore. Oh, oh, redacted appearances that consume human blank through two punctures on the blank. These details given. Let me minimize so many have been given strength to belief. Urban legends are not just stories for children, they're paranatural realities waiting to happen. The power of the mind, ladies and gents. And whoa, what in the hell? The building's shifted. Oh, yep. And that's the sound of the hiss coming in, dropping in. Uh oh, I, I guess I guess this is our first boss. Twenty minutes twenty minutes in. We have our first boss. Nice. Okay. Not a lot of powers right now. All I can, all I can do now is just take pot shots and hide. I hope I don't get hurt also. There is no regenerating health in this. I can the only way I can get health back is by just ouch! Is by killing enemies. Okay, come on. Sorry, Pulaski. Your ass is mine. You must cleanse control points. An enemy. Come on. Spread it. So, we need to cleanse these control points. Cleanse the control point. What does that mean? Help me fix it. Uh, I guess. Yeah, I can. Are you with us? With the Bureau? I can't tell you how happy I am to talk to somebody sane. The feeling's mutual. Yeah, I'm Pope, Emily Pope, and Dr. Darling's assistant. My turn. Should I lie? Jesse Faden. I'm just visiting. I should have lied. Oh, shit. You're the new director. Hold on. We're coming out. People. Director, Faden. Call me Jesse. Okay, Jesse. I'm Emily. Look, somehow this hostile force, this hiss, that works. Somehow the hiss managed to infiltrate the building without any warning. And just like that, my name for it is official. The hiss. Like the sound of poison gas leaking in. We're in full lockdown. It seems to have spread everywhere and to everyone not protected by an HRA. And, extraordinarily, you. You are the director, and that makes you special by definition. Trench is no longer the director, obviously. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm talking too much. This whole situation is just a lot. Trench is dead. Shot. 
Ah. I found his body. And the gun. Do I tell her it looked like a suicide? The service weapon. Also, and this can sound crazy, but he keeps appearing to me, saying things. It's hard to make out, but he told me to cleanse the control point, push the hiss out. The whole room shifted around. You did that? And you entered the building when it was already in the lockdown before you became the new director? How? I'm not ready to tell her about you yet. A janitor let me in. <laughs> I love it. This is fucking unbelievable. It's... I can't even... Ugh, look, Jesse, I have a million questions, and you probably have a million more. Like, do you know my brother Dylan? Not yet. But there's something I need to ask you to do first. If you can cleanse a control point, then you can maybe cure those infected or possessed by the hiss. Because if that's possible, our options are very different. Emily Pope. I don't know her, but I like her already. She's the opposite of the faceless agency I've blamed for what happened to me for so long. But I can't trust her yet. Or rather, the Bureau she's a part of. Yes. I can try. I'm speaking for you, of course. We can try it together. What? what okay. Even is that you blue circle? We did it before. Push the hiss out. Okay, so we've got to cleanse this guy, I think. Hello? It's not creepy. <laughs> Oh. It didn't work. The hiss has burrowed too deep. Ripping it out rips them apart. Hell. Okay. There's a collectible in here. Oop, no, not that. Hiss agents. The hiss manifests in human hosts in numerous ways. The most common and least intense form is seen in the many corrupted agents floating throughout the Bureau. His agents have maintained the human appearance, undergoing no physical transformation. The most notable distinction from unaffected humans is the fact that they levitate. His that display no aggressive behavior, only seem interested in vocalizing the strange incantation ad infinitum. Perhaps these vessels are only meant to propagate the his corruption like spores or Wi-Fi boosters, or are they cocoons, preparing to enter the next stage of evolution? When attacked, his agents disappear, perhaps entering a state of invisibility or undergoing a transformation into a purely resonant form. Research is ongoing. Hmm. Well, I guess we better get back to Pope. Jesse, Since over here. Since that didn't work. We need to make a plan, Jess. I can't cleanse them. I saw. It was worth a shot. Thank you, Director. Jesse. I'm gonna tell her why I'm here. I'll risk it. Listen. The Bureau was involved in an incident in my hometown, Ordinary, 17 years ago. The Bureau came in and covered the whole thing up. I've been looking for this place for a long time. That's enough. Maybe that's too much already. I can't tell her about Dylan and the rest yet. I've seen mentions of an altered world event case dealing with Ordinary. You were at Ground Zero as a child? It was one of the big ones, and before my time. And very classified. I can try to dig out some old files for you. My boss, Casper Darling, would know, but he's missing. I think he knew this was coming, or suspected. He came up with the HRAs, the Hedron Resonance Amplifiers. I think they're what saved us. A few of us. And Director Trench would know. Trench. The ghost, or whatever he is. He mentioned something called the hotline. Said I should find it. 
it's another object of power like the gun, an old Bakelite telephone, a direct line of communication between the director and the board. Maybe he can talk to you more clearly through that. I mean, Trench has years and years of experience. He might know how to destroy the hiss. Where is the hotline? It's kept in the communications department through the mail room. It's part of this sector, so we can access it even with the lockdown in place. We'll get the door open for you. Okay, that's my next stop. That's Tomasi's department. He's the head of communications. I don't think he had an HRA. He kind of made a point about not wearing one earlier. Keep an eye out. They call me the director. But that's not me. I'm not a director type. I'm not a leader. Why am I here? I think you already know. Yes, I came for my brother, but there are other reasons too. I said I was looking for answers, but I might never understand them. I'm not looking for proof. This is already it. More than enough. No matter what they told me all those years, I know it's real now. I didn't imagine this. I want to be a part of this world. What scares me shitless is that I finally found it. Only to see the hiss destroy it all. <laughs>